What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Endless Uploads. On today's show, we take a look at some of the most insane camera moments caught on camera. So we got a lot of videos to check out, so let's show. Right, what's up, guys? And what? Because she's a lesbian. Let's jump right into it. She swims in and she's proud. It's 2022. Get over your dyke. It's gross. Get over your homophobic. You're gross. So are you. You gonna drive away now? Get their license plate, babe. It will. Um, hi, I'm at the Broadmoor Plaza in Richmond, and there's two girls in a car, and they're screaming at us. They just came out, and they're banging on our window, yelling a bunch of homophobic slurs at us. I, um, Broadmoor, like Williams and Free Road. O A D, I think M O O R. Mitsubishi. Easy one. So this next woman was enjoying her time in Las Vegas when she gets assaulted by this creepy guy out of nowhere. Parked in a public street and minding her own damn business when this crazy Karen appeared out of nowhere and started complaining all because she was smoking a cigarette. So let's check out the full clip. You guys make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on all of these crazy situations. You are now watching Endless Uploads. You were you standing the, there watching me and my you family. Can, you you said be, it was for tweaker reasons. You can be the whitest person on this planet. Do I look like there. a tweaker? I don't know. If this but you're not watching them. You're watching me. You know, you're being awful idiotic. Am I? Yes, you are. And you're being very, very discriminative. Uh, you're the one that's being discriminated. No, I'm not. We came to this public street I right have... outside of a public storage unit and parked to smoke a cigarette. Your... I don't have to. Your mouth and I don't have it. to. I do not have right to. Right now, you're blocking traffic. And I just asked you a question. I don't care. I'm here to ask you why you were staring at me and my family. You said because you because had tweakers had parking and camping. It has nothing to do with me. Garbage, had nothing to do with I me. Had had nothing to do with me, but you sat here and watched me up until the time that I drove away. Why don't you call That's racial profiling. Why don't you call a cop and get him here? I don't have to. I we'll could just make a, a civil suit against you now that we'll I have, have this. Good conversation. I could just make a civil suit. You're so fucking ugly. That's the oh. problem. You are now watching this uh, so The next video, Karen must have really been fed up with these Amazon delivery drivers because he was waiting for this guy at his store, even though he wasn't delivering to his home. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let us know in the comments. Have you ever had any issues with Amazon delivering your stuff? Let us know, man. This is Endless Uploads. Y'all, this man was waiting on me at the door. I wasn't even delivering to his house. Yes, I'm cussing right in your damn phone, and I'm not ashamed about it one fucking bit. You fucking stupid bitches that come out here and park any way you want to park, or even park the wrong way. Have a good day. You have a fucking bad day, bitch. Excuse me? You fucking ugly slut. Uh, so our next crazy Karen gets into a very heated confrontation with this motor driver. Let's jump right into it. Maybe you should back off then. No, I'm like, just, I I'm my fuel tank is leaking, and she's like, "Don't out. park here. I'm trying to I'm leave in five minutes." About. I'm like, "Yeah, you're not in the way at all." So I'm like, not in the way at all, and I'm like, "There's a not. gas leak," and she's like, "But I just want to have enough room to back up and then go." Out I can move it when you're ready to leave. Okay. Awesome. But Thank I'm you. trying to see why my gas tank's leaking. No, I understand. I know. Plus, you're handicapped. You've got plenty of room. Thank you. I'm sorry, your gas tank is. 
Yeah, it seems like you're just being like really mean to him. Like he's just trying to check his gas tank out. So if you're gonna be a caring, you can get back in your car and wait for him to finish his thing. Yeah. Thanks, Karen. Yeah, see you, Karen. Bye. 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 Uh, so these next group of parents were just trying to get their kids during this tornado warning, but the school administration was making it really hard for them. So let's check out the full video. You guys, make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. You are now watching Endless Upload. I want my child. What's your name? I am her mom. What grade is she? She's in fifth. She's in sixth grade. Juju. Her name is Juju. 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 Ju
what happens next. I ain't never seen no crazy shit like this before, man. Let's check it out. Am I really seeing what I'm seeing? Who the f just let their baby out the house? What the f Wow. I'm about to go out to the street. What the f Whose baby is this? Come on. So our next crazy Karen has an epic meltdown at the store and things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full video and you guys make sure to like and subscribe and hit that bell for notifications. You do not miss out on the craziest Karens of 2023. I don't know we got y'all covered, man. Craziest Karens, craziest public freakouts. Just crazy shit in general, man. Y'all stay tuned, man. This is the Endless Uploads. We love y'all. Oh, let me. I'm 40 years old. So am I. Why do you have a bottle in your hand? I'll crack it right over your f***ing head. You're threatening me? You just told me you want to fight. We got you on video. I'm 30 years old. Yeah, you just said you was 40 years old. You're going to throw a bottle at me? You know I nothing about me. You're going to throw a bottle at me? You know nothing about me. Put the bottle down. Walk the f*** away. Man, you walk the f*** away. You walk away. Come on. We're calling the cops on you right now. That's fine. I call the cops right now. Right now. I call the cops. You're going to steal the bottle? I'll she's stealing it. Now. now she's stealing. Now she's stealing. And she's going to walk away, too. The cops know about it. They know about what? My son's eyeball being removed. What does that have to do with you wanting to... I haven't seen my kid in you wanna, six fucking years. I wonder why. Because you're a trash bag kind of mother. Fucking father is a trash bag. Why can't you be there for him then? None of your business. Exactly, because you're smoking F crack. Because you're a dirty fucking trash. Hey, what's up, guys? And ladies, let's check it out. No, 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 no. I'm keeping this, believe me. So I'm here to ask you, what are you going to do about this? Because holy shit. Hanging up and not answering the phone afterwards is not what you're supposed to do. I'm stuck in the drive-thru. Stuck in a drive-thru? I might have just okay. contracted salmonella. Okay. I'm a fucking army contractor. Am I supposed to walk into that fucking base? Okay. Do so, no, I got one another fucking sandwich. First off, I need my motherfucking money back. Money back, like, now. That's what I First off, second off, just like I said on the phone, I need the contact info for your franchise owner so I can talk to them about this. Because I promise you, you don't want my fucking attorney involved in a fucking lawsuit against you. We could have just really accomplished something not having to go that far if you just would have talked to me on the damn phone. Not worry about fucking curly fries in a drive thru Ah, uh, so this next guy gets into a very heated confrontation with his caring girlfriend at this parking lot. Let's check it out. Hey, do you really need me to call the police? Don't say f me. Get it together. Stop you hitting him. Together, Stop it. hitting him. Ma'am, you got to stop hitting him. I don't want to call the police. Okay, well, don't, don't, don't. Hey. Stop. Come on now. <laughs> I hope y'all have a good night and figure. So our next guy gets completely owned by this waitress who is sick and tired of his sh Let's check it out. Nobody wants to wait on you. We're asking you nicely. We'll be very nice. Please just leave. That's it. You got a cup of coffee out of us. What more do you want? That's it. I'm not, you're not going to call me a bitch. You're not going to sit down my boss's wife. You're not going to call people a lesbian. You sure as hell ain't going to look at underage girls. I don't look at underage girls. Let's go. Hey, come on. You're a pedophile and a freak. You deserve to be locked up in Bellevue. And that's all I got to say. And I'm asking you nicely. Ah, so this next guy gets into a very heated argument with three Karens about whether Asian hate crimes are a thing or not. Let's Welcome check it out. Racism at a bar I went to tonight. 
I just heard Asian hate and I'm over that whole narrative because what is the Asian hate? There's no Asian hate? There's no Asian hate. That is an actual criminal offense. I mean, I don't see the Asian hate. I don't see the Asian hate. I totally agree with both of you that there's There have been so many protests about Asian hate. Oh my god. Pay attention to what? Yeah. Okay, but now you're saying you're saying all these Asian people are being discriminated against. So okay, you said that so many color. times, and I think that's the one thing you've said that I can agree with. You're okay. You being a person of so color. I'm not white. Just let you guys know. You guys. Oh my. God, I know you've said it like okay, four so times. Let's go. Yeah, I feel oppressed. How? How do you feel oppressed? Because I'm a minority in the U.S. Oh, like, jump on the bandwagon, dude. Like, really? In what way, though? What way are you? Are you not able to get a job? You can't go to school. You can't get an education. You can't get it. Like, tell me how. Hate speech. Hate crime. I was racially profiled this week. Yeah, I know what race. I'm not saying either of you to feel the screen okay, against, but you funny. being a okay. Like? See, you want me. <laughs> The coronavirus? You're aware of the coronavirus. Okay, so you know what's happening with that. And do you know the amount of Asian people who are attacked because of that, calling it the China virus, the fact that you're beaten down for the fact there are legal records about it? It sucks like 10 times worse when it's your own people, but apparently Asian hate isn't real, so I learned that tonight. That internalized racism, that belief that just because you don't experience something means that other people don't experience it, that everything has to do with your own self-actualization of real world events blows my fucking mind. Definitely love being told I don't experience racism. It's like up there, top five turn-ons, top five kinks. Mm. So our next guy accuses these employees of racially profiling him while he was at this store. Let's Who check it out. Racially profiling me every single time I come here. She goes out of her way to be like, oh, I'm gonna be, you th I think you're gonna steal. No way, please. No way, racial profiling. Please, we, we do not video, video in the store. Call the cops. Yeah, do what you're doing. Yeah, do what you need to do. Here for two months straight. Because racial profiles against these, I know you ain't justifying. You probably are, you know. Of course, I you am. know how racism is in America. Of course, you are. Yeah. Of course, they get the white guy over here. Like that's gonna mediate something. Thank God for what? I'm not doing nothing. I didn't do anything wrong. So thank God to protect me. <laughs> to protect me from you guys. Racial profiling. We are gonna call the, call the cops. Call the cops. We will. And you'll get in trouble. You'll probably lose your job, bro, for being a racist. Yeah, I don't think so. What's your name, Steven? Steven. Okay, Steven, the racist that Aaron has an epic meltdown over a parking spot, and I promise you, you will not believe what happens next. Let's check it out. See? She was yelling at staff and running through the store.
following me, don't harass me. Back up. Back up and stop talking to me. Yeah, you are. You, this is harassment. I already said I'm leaving, so shut up and let me go. of an RV parked from a Karen. You want to search my car for alcohol? You want to search the tent for alcohol? I, can I don't drink. You. You're drunk right now. I'm not sure. We're not. You woke us up. <laughs> we oh, barely why? even got sleep were... last night because it was fucking cold. Oh, because y'all were making a fire until 3 a.m. on the beach. We're teenagers. Oh, that's what teenagers This is going to get you some good reviews. Listen, you better... You better watch don't your mouth, me. young little boy. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Yeah, don't touch me. You've made threats to me? I've made threats? Yeah. What about He I just asked you not to touch him. Told you I ain't cleaning that up because it ain't gas. What do you mean? You're cursing me? Because You're you came over me? here very disrespectful. Listen, this is if quiet I didn't time. know that I couldn't do that, I this wouldn't have never done quiet it. Time. Give me this my is space. Quiet time. You need to give me my space. You need to give me my space. Six feet. COVID time. Oh, please. <laughs> Here's your little gasoline can. Yeah. Yeah. We literally admitted that we did it. Oh, but but someone did. told us that we could. If I didn't know, I know. that we couldn't have done it, no, I would have never done it. Where's your camera proof? No, they didn't. Thanks Were you here? Me. Were you here? Were you Get here? Get my license plate. Get what you need to do. So this next veteran was just trying to enjoy his time at this event when he comes across this crazy Karen who makes his life extremely difficult. Let's check it out. Am I illegal American? I don't know. Am I illegal American? I, I couldn't see it here on the, I the screen. I fought for this country in the Jared U.S. Johnson, Air Force, are you sir. available? Why the hell would you think no, I'm not illegal oh American? God. Turn oh, the fuck yes. back around and don't talk to me. You're just not light enough. He's not currently on it. I'm doing Okay. Am I a legal uh, American? Are you? Uh, so the next guy has been saving up for months to get a car, but it's the surprise of a lifetime from his grandpa. Let's check it out. <laughs> no. Oh. I'm about to cry. <laughs> He cried. He's right, man. What have you seen, Hannah? What have you seen on the box? Welcome back to another episode. Don't fucking touch me! Get the f out of here! Call sexual abuse, you fucking shit! He literally I grabbed my ass. Is that a guy that works here? No, that guy grabbed my ass. Are you security? Excuse me. Do you work here or are you security? A guy just. Security is right there. He's in the restroom. He literally just fucking. He literally grabbed me. He literally just grabbed me. There's a man that just broke me. Sorry, like I, I'm filming it because no, I'm glad that you're filming because yeah. that happens and it's fucked up. He put his hands up my first, and he literally grabbed me. What a fucking sicko! You know, it's, 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 this has happened to me one time before in Santa Monica. I regret it so much not stopping and like doing something yeah. about it. I told myself if that ever happens again, I'm not gonna like just let it happen because that shit is so fucked up. He That's literally put assault. his hand up my skirt, like. Are you gonna say sorry? Are you gonna say sorry? No, 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 he, he ran away. Oh, he ran away. He ran but away. I heard him when I was going to Thank you for letting us know. Oh, 
say. Yeah. But I heard him talking about it. Yeah, yeah he said we were crazy. He didn't want to show her skirt. Yeah. We're going to get you to get a statement. Okay. This is the kind of stuff that women have to deal with. And then he, and he, you see how he went off and he started talking about how I'm crazy? Yeah. What the like, Men are disgusting. It doesn't matter how you're dressed, you don't get to grab a woman. This happens all the time. So if you guys see this guy, let us know who it is. Drop it in the comments because that's that's you mess. Okay? I have to stop the video so we could show security. I keep like restarting this because I keep fumbling over my words because there was a lot of different comments and there's a lot of like, I'm feeling a lot of different emotions. So I'm trying to just chill out and just do one thing at a time. So first off, um, no, it wasn't staged. That's the most insensitive thing that I think anybody could literally say in response to that. I have the, this is a press charges. This is the report. The event number is right here. Victims information guide. Like I, that's wild. Next is there's a lot of comments that are literally the reason why women don't speak up for themselves or don't stand up for themselves and i know and i want to just appreciate i want to thank the people that are in the comments like literally defending women because it's wild to me some of the things that come out of people's mouths and how it's like somehow justified um so yeah i i'm, I'm literally just like it's comments like that it's people like that that literally make us women children boys men this happens to boys too but it makes people not speak up about it when people are gaslighting you or victim blaming or making an excuse for someone that just touched you that's wild it's wild like okay i have a video that happened two days later so this is to give context because they did catch him they found him, but um, they detained him. The security at the Palazzo did. and But I needed to make a video to explain what happens in between because it wasn't just like, oh, they caught him. Um, they caught him so that I could press charges. They questioned me. They got all of his information. I don't know. I'm still following up on it. It's like I have to get the police report. But they, he was detained while questioning took place and then they couldn't just like take him to jail so he was detained and he was let go so it was good that they caught him but then like then he had to be let go which i found out after i spoke after the cops came so fuck i feel like this is a mess but okay so after that happened basically i was there in vegas with three of my girlfriends for uh the magic fashion convention so it was for a work trip it was the it was also sponsored like the hotel was taking care of us which is also, so basically what we had to do in order to get this taken care of, I had to write a report, I had to go to security, I had to, we went to the front desk, we filed a, we like, we had to be loud, we had to be loud and aggressive, we called the cops, um, we, oh fuck, I'm running out of time. Oh. So me and my I'm uncle found a carrot. I'm the father of these children. We're not damaging a penis. It ain't private over there. I'm sorry, sir, but it's private property. You need to leave. Okay, give us five minutes. No, now. What? what? All right, I don't see anything that says off the private property. There's not trespassing anywhere. We're not impeding anything. We're not soliciting. We're recording the video. So we're not breaking any laws or breaking any rules. Not, you never asked for permission to come on the property to do a video. I've been here before. We come many yeah. times record here. For years. I lived here for over 20 years. I don't care, sir. I'm telling you, this is private property and you need to leave. Okay, and guess what we'll do? We'll walk across the street then. How about that? I don't care what you do on the other side of the street. That's okay, we're well, right there those trees are, are the end of the property. We'll be right there. Thank you very much. Thank you, Karen. I got my wallet today. Okay. And I wanted to see if you'd be able to like possibly buy my lunch for me. Your lunch? Sure, of course. No Is that okay? Yeah. And that's $20. Yeah, that's fine. Because you guys were so nice to just give me money for my lunch, I would love to buy you and your family's Christmas presents. I'm going to give you guys $500. Wow. So, <laughs> for Christmas, <laughs> man. <laughs> oh, she's holding it. <laughs> 
beat me. You must have walked in there, you know? <laughs> Make sure to like and subscribe. Until next time, guys, more Karens. <laughs>